Spooky. Are you sure, sure? You want to climb these stairs too? Max, it said it's dangerous here. You are risky. Y yes. Again, my risky little me is going to climb the bastions of the garrison yard. Yay! Great job. High five. Good. Yes. What are you doing? You silly man. What did you find? Uh oh. Good morning, dear friends. It's a wonderful spring morning here, and Max is taking me to our ancient fortress. If you are new to our channel, this is Katie and Max and we are so much happy to see you here with us. Join us, subscribe and hit that bell button to get notifications about our new videos. Say hi! Hi! Let's go to buy a ticket! On the rocky cape in the city of Belgorod Nistrovsky is located a medieval fortress, Belgorod Nistrovsky, near Odessa, which recently celebrated its 2500th anniversary. Max! It is considered to be the oldest places in Ukraine. Wait for mommy! <laughs> Along with the Rome and Athens, it's one of ten most ancient towns in the world. This fortress will certainly impress you with its size. The total length of its walls is over 2 kilometers. Powerful defensive walls and towers that have been preserved in its original form until present days show us how important and impractical this construction was. Ackermann is the biggest fortress in the country and unique monument to the defensive architecture of the 13th and 15th centuries. Despite its age and all the historical events that it has witnessed, the fortress managed to preserve its original structure. Okay. Today, it is considered to be the best preserved medieval fortification facility in Ukraine. Okay. Are we going up? Ackermann Fortress was found on the ruins of the ancient Greek town Tyr. To the right side of the main entrance to the fortress you might see the, this ancient city being under excavations. The need to protect the town from the constant invasions of the enemies was the main reason for the construction of huge first fortress. Now this is the funniest place for him because he has tiny rocks here to throw, right? Mm. <laughs> So we, we can see they are also making some repairing, some reconstruction. Since we have a new mayor, she's taking care of our town really good. More than 10 years, our government didn't tell, take care of our town, of these four trees. And finally, we have some movements in this case. It's a huge job, you know, and she did so many things in a short period of time. And I'm happy that our fortress is in good hands. So guys, we're actually coming closer to so-called Pushkin Tower, because uh, famous Russian poet 
was living here for a while. It took 20 years to build a defensive fortress on its territory. In the 15th century, the Turks captured this fortress and named it Akaman. That means white stone, due to the fact the fortress was built of chalk stone. Are you eager to see more? Come on, let's go. No? You will stay here forever? You want to see what is there? Turks ruled the territory for over 300 years. In the early 19th century, Russian Empire claimed the fortress as a spoil of victory after the Russian-Turkish War. Walking on the site of defensive walls, you might feel all the scale of this construction. There are 34 towers were built. Each of them had its own purpose, as well as for living or food keeping. So we are actually entering the second yard. There are three yards in this fortress. And are you trying to make echo? In order to maximize efficiency of defense, walls and towers were equipped with the battlements and embrasures. Are you sure, sure? You want to climb these stairs too? No, Max, it's not a pretty good idea. It's not a good idea, Max. No, no. This is actually another entrance to the second yard. Some of towers have their own names according to the associated legends. These are Avidia's Tower, Pushkin Tower, Dungeon, Ta Treasure House and others. They were built the way they could be used for defense. Max, it said it's dangerous here. You are risky. Yes. You are such a risky little guy. Mm -mm -mm. We're gonna have a serious talk with you tonight. Yay! Great job! High five? Good! And all these lovely human beings enjoying <laughs> awesome view. What do we have here, Max? Once you have visited the fortress, you'll see how people lived in the Middle Age. The fortress is of two defensive levels, inner defensive walls divided into four yards. This construction was perfectly planned for the most effective defense. Again, my risky little man is going to climb the bastions of the garrison yard. You can see that each generation has brought something new. Like for example, you can see a mosque built by the Turks on the ruins of Orthodox Church. Stables, barracks and arsenal were located in garrison yards. Port Court has badly preserved, it was used for trade. The most interesting place for visitors is Citadel, 
four corners of which are pointed with the most powerful towers. There was a commandant yard. The fortress is rounded with a moat of 20 meters deep, which was filled with water. Special halls for boiling water and pitch. It's amazing, right? you guys enjoy today's video and this amazing fortress tour so don't forget to give us big thumbs up for this video and subscribe if you didn't subscribe yet we are having so much fun here too much sun <laughs> hey little guy what are you up to there? <laughs> Let's go. What are you doing? You silly man. <laughs> like mommy, like son. <laughs> Come on, clean your head. Good job. Give me a high five. Opa. Come on, let's go, Max. Thank you. You're so kind. I was climbing all these walls and one time I fall down really badly I twisted my ankle and had really really hard Oh! 
Uh oh. Did you pretend you were a prisoner? Many movies were filmed here and also every year great celebration, festivals, nightly tournaments and colorful theatrical performances are taking place in these forties. Check your leg, listen to man, come on. Catch up with mommy. So now it is time to go home to have our dinner. And oh, mama as always has so much work to do. It was awesome day. It was awesome fun. Max enjoyed today's day so so much. Don't forget to give us big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you didn't subscribe yet. We are having so much fun here. Don't forget to hit that bell button to get notifications about new videos. I will see you next time, guys. I love you all and sending you so much hugs and kisses. Love you, friends. See you next time. Bye.